um, my name is Melissa and I'm from Kids Have Hope. I wanted to share with you the body safety rules that I teach children when I go into schools. Um, this is just a short version of it, but I thought it would be helpful uh, for parents and teachers and basically anybody uh, to teach kids or to show kids this video um, body safety rules uh, on how to stay safe against abusers. Um, the first rule that I teach kids is that um, it's my body. I have them point to the ceiling and say it's my body and basically it means their body belongs to them. Uh, nobody has the right to touch them in a way they don't like or they don't understand. Um, if they don't feel like giving a hug that day, they don't have to. It's a very empowering tool. Um, and they enjoy this one because it's a chant. They usually chant it throughout the day, sometimes throughout the week. It's really, it's a really good one. Um, number two is to trust yourself. Um, if you feel like something is wrong, you are right. Uh, so I teach the little kids that you know you have an uh oh feeling. Sometimes somebody says something that just doesn't seem right or touches you or stands too close to you and you don't feel like it's right. Trust yourself. Question it. Maybe get away. Whatever you have to do, trust that. Um, trust your your inner being. We teach them early on about that. That's a good one. Um, number three, say no. We teach them how to say no, that it's okay to say no. Um, teach them early about this one. This one, this teach them as early as possible. This stays with you uh, for the rest of your life. Um, you never know when you may need this. But what's important about this one is that uh, sadly enough, children are often abused by somebody that they know, by somebody that they trust, by somebody that they love. Um, so they're scared. They're scared to say no to that person. We reassure them that it's okay. It's okay to say no. If you don't feel good, if you don't feel right about it, it's okay, it's okay to say no. So do put on that mean face and say no that's what i say to them and and we do we put on our mean faces we say no you don't have to do it mean but you can say no and you can get away um so we do that we say no and we we say it's okay it's okay to say no um and number four tell somebody uh important so important tell somebody um if somebody's hurting you something's not right you don't feel right uh, talking to you, um, whatever it may be, tell somebody. We come up with a list of people that um, you know that you can tell. You know, um, can you tell you know your mom, your teacher, your dad? Um, you know, and we we come up, we we brainstorm a little bit. You know, who could you tell? Can you tell your dog? No, we can't tell our dog, but we could tell you know. Um, the counselor or somebody somebody at school so there's different people in our lives that we can tell and if somebody I also tell them and um, this is important if somebody does not listen it doesn't mean they don't care it means maybe they weren't listening that day but to keep telling it's important so that we can stop it um, and for adults uh, children do not lie about child sexual abuse so listen to them and believe them believe them the first time um, this must stop. This must end. So um, please do. Please do listen. Please do believe. Um, believe them. And number five, uh, very importantly, abuse is never the child's fault. Um, tell them that. It is not your fault. Uh, if somebody hurts you, touches you, whatever it may be, it is not your fault. Uh, sometimes they are told it is their fault. Sometimes um, people grow up thinking it is their fault. Abuse is never the child's fault. Um, that's what we tell them and that is the truth. So these are all the body safety rules um, that we teach the children when we go into schools. Uh, they are very important. These are things that the children, they're weightless. They're things that the children can take with them. Um, when they when they go out into the world, when we are not with them, but they will have them, they will remember them, um, and and just please please teach them how special they are because they are, and um, tell them that you know they're one of a kind, 
and uh, thank you for listening and much love.